Hello guys and welcome back to another video. So in today's video, I'm going to show you how you can remove the jailbreak from your iOS device. So it's a simple but little complicated process. So make sure to watch the video till the very end. And if you're new to my channel, please consider subscribing as I bring more tech related content almost every day now as I'm trying to be consistent. So before wasting further time, let's head straight to the video. So my name is Rohit and you're watching SnapTech. So let's get started. So as you can see currently I have an iPhone 5s which has been jailbroken using the check ring. If I will open this you can see the Siri icon and I will install the Siri as well. So you can see that it's completely jailbroken. So now in today's video we are going to just remove the jailbreak from this device. So let's head straight to our PC. So to remove the jailbreak from your device you just need this one file FRP file AIO version 2.8.4. So there will be a link in the description below to download this file. So once you do that just unzip this somewhere on your PC so once you do that you need to copy this folder which you extracted and go to your this PC go to your C drive and paste it over here so once you copy this folder just open this folder and inside this open this FRP file AIO 2.8 application and once you do that it will be written no device connected because I haven't connected my device yet because there is just one more step to do so first you have to just click here click to register for free if you click that one pop-up will open and go to this first link once you do that just scroll down and click here click to register and you need to wait 30 seconds before you can register this software So once it's on zero you need to paste your serial number over here so let's go to our software and you can file the serial number okay we can't see the serial number because we have not connected our device so once you connect your device you can see the serial number over here so I have registered it before so but I will still do it to show you how you can do it so once you click on this serial number it will automatically copy on your clipboard so then go back and click here and just paste your serial number control V and click on submit so once you do that your software will get registered and you will get this registered status over here so once it's done we can directly go on to remove the jailbreak and fix banking apps as banking app doesn't work on the jailbreak device so on the right bottom corner you can see my device as well doing the whole process so as you can see currently our device is connected iphone 5s were running on ios version 12.5.4 I may number, serial number and everything. So once you do that, just click on remove jailbreak and fix banking apps. It will take some time so you need to be a little patient and sit back and relax. So as you can see the jailbreak removing process has been done and now it says that we should restart our device now. So let's move to our device again. So as you can see the CDI has been removed automatically before so now we will just restart our device.
Okay, we can't open the check again. As you can see, like we were able to open it before. So as you can see, the check screen app is just crashing because the jailbreak has been removed. Now we'll connect it to our PC to see whether it's jailbroken or not on the same very software. So let's move to our PC. You can still see my device on the right bottom corner and as you can see our device is connected currently. And once you connected it automatically got restarted again. And you can see over here the status jailbreak cannot. That means jailbreak has been removed. So this is how you can remove the jailbreak from your iOS device. So, so if you enjoyed this video, please hit that like button. If you're new to my channel, please consider subscribing. So this is it for this video. I'll meet you in the next one. Snaptech signing out.